It's game two of the NLCS featuring the Dodgers and the Brewers. Justin Turner looks to bounce back from a tough game one as the Brewers look to jump ahead in the series two games to nothing. Let's see how it all turns out. We'll pick it up in the first inning with David Fries looking to go deep, but Lorenzo Cain has another plan in mind. Fries hits it in the air into right center field. Back at the wall. It is caught by Cain. He just took an extra base away from David Fries with a leaping grab up against the wall in deepest right center at the Dodger bullpen. That one may have gotten out of here. I think it would have cleared the barrier. Not by much, but I think it would have cleared it. That is way better than any double play a pitcher can get. One down for Orlando Arcia. Into center. Bellinger just into the game. Goodbye. Arcia goes deep, and it's 1 0 Brewers in game two. He hit it out of here in the deepest center field. High towering drive. Bellinger, who just came into the game, went back to the wall and tried, but nothing happened. Arcia gives the Brewers a 1 0 lead with his second home run postseason play. Biggest moment of the game upcoming. The pitcher Miley is at third base. Kane is at second. Yelich at first. Braun 0 for 2. Matson, the big hard throwing right hander, delivers. Come backer slowly hit to short. Barehanded play by Machado throws to first out at first base. But in to score is Miley. And the Dodgers take a two to nothing lead. A terrific play by Machado to get Braun at first. Second and third. There's two out, but two in. Aguilar 254 with runners in scoring position this year. The pitch. He strikes out swinging. Here's Shaw. Did he get enough back at the wall? It is gone. Travis Shaw has just given Milwaukee a three to nothing lead. Roberts wanted Wood to get the two lefties. Well, they got the first one, didn't get the second. Big spot for Bellinger, his first plate appearance of the game. Up the middle of big set. Muncy will come to the plate. Machado will hold it second and the Dodgers are on the board. It's three to one. A uh, big hit for Bellinger and obviously a big one for this Dodger ball club and they have to be feeling right now that they can be back in this ball game. They have uh, squandered opportunities last night left a tying run at third base in the ninth inning and here comes Council to make yet another pitching change. The count is three and one with one out and the base is loaded. Jeffress to Barnes. Ball four. It's now three to two. Barnes walks with the bases loaded. Machado comes in to score. Now Baez to Braun. And a fly ball to right center field. Long run for Bellinger and Puig. And Bellinger makes a sliding catch in the outfield. If he doesn't get there, that's an RBI. Instead, it's the final out of the seventh. A beautiful play turned in by Cody Bellinger. Josh Hader, their all-star, and their lights-out left-hander is unavailable, at least it's the plan for Craig Council. Sometimes plans change. Two balls and no strikes. Taylor leads from first. Jeffress delivers. Fly ball to left. It's on its way, and it is gone! A home run for Justin Turner! When they needed a home run the most, they turned to Turner. A two-run shot, and the Dodgers take a 4-3 to three lead. Two out, and this game comes down to a battle between Kenley Jansen and the presumed NL MVP Christian Yelich. Perez, the tying run at second. One ball, two strikes. Yelich rolls it slowly to third. Turner has it, throws to first, and he's out at first base. The Dodgers pull all even. It's a game of peace. It's now a best of five. Four to three Dodgers is your final. So the Brewers' winning streak ends at 12 as the series is now tied at one game apiece. Wade Miley pitched to Jem five and two thirds, no runs on just two hits with three strikeouts. He also went two for two at the plate and scored a run to help his own cause, but the bullpen couldn't hold the lead. And Cody Bellinger, who was 0 for his last 24 in postseason play, would single in the seventh to end the skid.